Hi, I'm back with another video, and this time it's recapping the summer. I thought that would be kind of a fun idea to go back over and see if I can remember everything that happened over the summer. There's no particular order, because some of it I remember, and some of it I don't remember what day or month it was on. So, let's see. Um, back in, what was it, May? We got rid of, we finally got rid of that tree that had been near the house that we were worrying about. I finally got a new charger cord for my phone. I've been needing that for a while. The um, part that plugs in, it like busted on one side and I used to be able to click it back on and then as time wore on, I guess it I guess it couldn't go back in right so it became really hard to keep it, keep it closed and that was kind of scary. So I finally was able to get that through Verizon. I don't have Verizon, but my phone's like associated with Verizon. And so I was finally able to get that. Um, I'd been looking and I couldn't find any because everybody's like reviews and stuff were talking about how some of these things were bad and so I was kind of like I guess I could just go through them now one of these days I need to find a f um, phone case my mom used to have a hard time finding phone cases for her phone and I'm, I got the same problem every time I see one it's like oh it don't fit and then when I finally do find one all of a sudden they're sold out because everybody else apparently has that same phone so yeah that's kind of annoying we had a few unexpected purchases this last um, month or two. I'm going to do some videos on those. I haven't done it yet. I need to. We got a new palm pump um, back in, what was it, May or June. We did lose one fish. That was more than what we wanted to lose, of course. But we were expecting to be way more. But I was glad I was able to um, get that palm pump through um, Amazon. I wish they had them in the stores. I just remember, you know, used to be able to go into, like, Walmart or Lowe's and just grab one and then all of a sudden they stopped having them and it's like So now you gotta go to like I said online And so going through Amazon and doing Amazon Prime gets it to you a lot faster versus everybody else Being like into you know next week or something um, I read the Holly horror book that I have um, I'm waiting I can't wait for the second book I actually like the first one. I can't wait for the second one. I took a break on the um, reading. I decided, you know, I have so many books. I need to start reading some of them. And I kind of decided to just take a break since I read so many at the beginning of the year. I read, like, a, quite a bit, like, um, comic books and online and in person, you know, comic books and um, free books and free comic books and books I have and books I won and books I've gotten and that kind of thing. So I'm like, I need to take a break and get back on that one these days. Um, you know, I've been to all these a few times over the summer. Got those new steak knives. I'm still trying to get used to those steak knives. They're kind of different. I think because I'm so used to the old ones that it's, it feels weird. I'm still loving my cooking knives that I got from there. Um, I'm glad we've gotten to go to the out, Goodwill outlet again. Um, I can't wait to go back again. We're kind of waiting to go back to the um, antique stores and Ollie's. I mean, not Ollie's. Goodwill outlet, um, the antique stores, and some of them we haven't been to yet until it cools down because there's one I'd like to go to, but people were saying that it's, um, the air conditioning's not that great, and so they were like, you don't want to go there because, like, half the building is hot and the other half the building's, like, I guess, got air, and so we're just like, we don't want to be trapped in a building where there's no air, and then there's another one that I saw, I don't know if it's an antique store? Or a liquidation store I think it was listed as both but it had like this name I can't remember what it's called but I, I just I'll make a thought of my mom because it sounded like I think it was the Munsters or something and so I thought of my mom when I saw that and I was like I so want to go there so I think that's gonna be another one of those we gotta wait until it cools off because um, I can't remember where it's located but it's quite a ways away from us and we've talked about going to some of the other ones that we've been to in the past but we're kind of waiting. My Avon collection is growing. Um, I now have like tons of Avon perfume bottles and decanters and then um, like cologne ones and a bell and some makeup ones or face stuff. No, face stuff. I haven't gotten any like makeup ones. I just got the, like the face cream one that looked like and then the two um, some kind of face things. And then, of course, I've got a bottle that's real pretty. 
I um, I put in my antique shopping trip on the last day of August. Um, I got that cute little boy one that he looks like he's you know ready for bedtime. And got that Avon plate. And so that's been kind of you know I've been kind of enjoying the fact that I've got my collection up there. When I've gone into the antique stores, we were talking about because they were all excited when they saw the um, Avon. They're like, oh yeah, we have you know like. Some of these people have got plenty. I'm like that last day on August 31st when we went. And the lady was like, yeah, the guy sells a lot of them. And I'm like, yeah, I was down there checking them out. And then I said, yeah, I had quite a bit. And at least two or three of them have been like, wow, that's pretty neat when they found out how many I had. And they're like, come back, you know, keep coming back. I got more. Like that one lady going, I got a storage unit full. And Carol was like, you're kidding. I'm like, nope, she's got like a storage unit or a storage building or something. that she says she's got full of them and she's constantly changing them out and bringing in more I'm like we gotta go back and then of course I've added some more stuff to my wedding you know things like I got that new wedding cake topper which I thought was really cute and so I'd like to add more to that you know like some more little wedding stuff because I like that kind of thing um, I'd like to get some more little half dolls I'm hoping to one day get like the ones with the pin cushion attached or the little um, what is it called? It was a sweeper thingy. I forget what they, how they worded it. Whisk. Whisk thing? I think that's something along those lines. I'm hoping to get something like that. You know, pin cushions, the, the pillows I saw them on, um, the wheel whisk thing. Um, think them being attached to like makeup and beauty products and stuff that they used to hide their stuff in. I'd really like to do that. I'm not sure if I'm going to sew the two I got in on anything or if I'm just gonna leave them because I'm kind of got them sitting with my um my Avon stuff in my little cake stand from Dollar Tree I bought back in February no April April March February between February and April I can't remember when I got it but I got it sitting over there with all that stuff and they look real cute over there and I haven't decided if I like because I want to try and sew them into something I'm a little nervous about that because my sewing is not that great if my mom was here I'd, I'd ask her to do it because she could do it and make it look nice and stuff and I'm afraid of ruining something and having to take it apart and then you know changing my mind and so I'm really excited about that I'm hoping to get some more like I said half dolls because I think they're just so cute um let's see July wasn't hot for the first time that anybody can remember um my dad was telling me how it was probably going to break records because it was the first time it had never been hot that anybody could remember. Because, like, March we had bad storms like tornadoes, hail, that kind of stuff coming through. April we had fires near us. May was bad weather. It's always bad weather. It's always tornado season. Uh, June, I believe it rained for quite a bit of June. And then in July, I can't remember if it rained. I just know it wasn't as hot as it has been in the past. August was hot. We had a week of hot, and they kept saying that, reminding everybody every day, it's another day of hot, and we're all like, we already know that. And then it did cool down towards the end of August. Um, gotten to go into quite a bit of different antique stores near us and um, other areas. Those have been kind of fun. Can't wait to go back to a lot of them and find out some new places. Um, I made some pieces, homemade pieces and stuff. I haven't posted those videos yet. I'm still debating on them, but I probably will post them at a later date. I did try one of those um, one-person meal ideas. I'm hoping to get some more of those ideas and post the videos. You know, I'm, I did pasta salad this summer, pudding, and strawberry shortcake, and of course milkshakes. I did lots of milkshakes. My favorite is still mint. I don't know why I like mint milkshakes, but I do. I really, really like that. Um, I'm hoping to do more milkshakes in the future. Get some more ideas, different ice cream, and that kind of thing. Um, August, I celebrated. Let's see, my niece's birthday was in August. The anniversary of my mom's death was in August. It's been eight years. As um, I'm sure if anybody watched those videos I posted, um, I, that, was, that was a hard month for anniversary. For the anniversary, August is like just one of those bad months, and then. Um, then the Maui fires happened, and that was sad and horrible and awful. And then I saw where um, Terry Funk died. And, of course, that was sad. I figured, um, I was kind of hoping he wrestled his way out. Because, um, you know, I always thought he'd, he'd, his last match would be a wrestling on his deathbed match. 
So I kind of hope that's how we went out. And then, of course, the next day, Bray Wyatt died. And that was really sad. I couldn't believe it because I remember seeing where they said he had been sick. But then they said he was doing better. He had been cleared. And he was going to come back. And then all of a sudden, I'm checking everything. And I'd seen Terry Funk died the day before. And I was like, oh, that's sad. And then the next day, it was like I was checking everything. And it popped up saying, you know, that they had found out about the passing of him. And they announced it. And I'm like, oh, wait, what? So that was just, you know, that was just sad. I felt sorry for his family. And, um, because, like, like I said, it was, like, an already bad month. And then, of course, the whole summer always takes me back to, um, when, uh, Roddy Piper died. And then the American Dream Dusty Rose died. Because while my mom was sick, I can't remember who died first. I think it was Roddy Piper. And then the next one was Dusty Rose. I think that was how it went. I can't remember which one died first, but um, I remember when Dusty Rose died, my mom, of course, my mom was like, that's sad to hear about Roddy Piper, and then when Dusty Rose died, she thought about his kids, and how she felt bad for him, and so, um, I always think about that during the, during this time, um, I got my Oscar Mayer Wiener Mobile for my mom, for her little area, um, I got that early for, instead of waiting for Christmas time, it's still kind of cute, um, I got went home goods and got that um, got a few things there over the summer like the little Snow White um, salt and pepper shaker that in memory of my grandma and so yeah we did another, quite a bit of stuff over the summer kind of took a break oh Wendy's open so I've been we're still loving Wendy's and Taco Bell being open now that Taco Bell is open too um, we've been to Wendy's quite a bit we're trying not to burn ourselves out um, but I've had the strawberry shake now, where are we up to, four times? I think I'm up to four times now on the strawberry shake. It's getting better. It doesn't taste nearly as bad as I had thought it did on that first time. Maybe it's because it was, they were new at it. Um, I've had one, two, I think I've tried two different burgers of theirs. Um, I've had the chicken nuggets twice. Um, I've had the breakfast at least three or four times now. And I really like the little, um potato things that they give you. I call them potato wedges, but I really love those. Um, I'm, I'm still hoping, fingers crossed, that Wendy's will bring in the pumpkin spice frosty. Um, I've already tried for um, between August and the beginning of September, I've already started trying the pumpkin stuff. Um, I tried the Oreos pumpkin spice cookies. Um, I can't wait to try other pumpkin spice. I'm really excited about um, I'm always glad when summer's over with because, you know, it cool starts cooling down, hopefully. I do miss, you know, like strawberry shortcake and strawberries, you know, and all that kind of stuff. Because as time goes on, it stops becoming more, you know, available. But the, I do love it when it's time for um, fall because pumpkin spice, pumpkin spice donuts, pumpkin donuts, pumpkin spice muffins, pumpkin muffins, um, Starbucks. We're already talking about going back to Jamba Juice and getting... Um, their pumpkin uh, drinks if they have them um, like I said I can't wait I'm hoping the frosty comes in I'd like for to try um, what else is there oh I'm hoping that my grocery store gets the hefty pumpkin spice cinnamon pumpkin spice trash bags I'm hoping to get those um, I can't wait for soup and chili season it's always my favorite time of the year the first year I did it, I did. I didn't start until I think in December. I think last year I started in it was October or November. I'm wanting to start this year in this in September versus um, so late. So in the coming days I'm gonna be making me some chili. I've been thinking of chili, so I got already written down what I have and what I need. So I can't wait for like I said, soups and chilies and all the pumpkin spice enjoyments. Um, I also can't wait for peppermint frosties in December. I'm already counting down that. Me and Carol already counting down frosties, peppermint frosties. When I told her about the pumpkin spice, we were just talking about. It. She goes, "I know. I heard. We're both counting down, hoping that they get the pumpkin spice." Um, I think that is it. I don't think anything else has happened between now and when I'm making this video. 
Um, I hope everybody's summer was good. I hope everybody's um, August was good and their beginning of their September is going good since I didn't actually make this video until sep Labor Day. <laughs> um, the only thing I hate about each month is, you know, it's like the bills get paid and, you know, you're all excited. Bills are paid, groceries are bought, everything is good. And then, like my mom used to say, then the next month starts up and Bill finds you again. So, I've got to pay the bills here in a few days because I already got the starts of um, two bills. I've already paid one previously and I've got currently got two I need to pay. And then all the other bills start coming out and wanting to be paid on the same week at towards the end of the month. That's kind of annoying. And, um,. So I gotta pay those bills and wait for those. I've already paid the dumpster check from September to December. Um, I just went ahead and did that because I'm not quite sure of how everything was gonna work out. And so I needed to pay that at that moment. And so I did that. And so, so far the beginning of September is okay. So it ended, um, August was okay. Um, beginning of September so far is okay. I hope your Labor Day weekend was great. I hope your end of your August and your August was good. Or at least okay. I hope your summer was good or at least okay. I hope everybody's kids are back in school and are safe and good. Um, don't forget about all the kids returning to school if they haven't already. Look for the, all the lights. Look for kids crossing the road. Remember they don't always watch where they're going. And try to stay safe. Um, anywhere near swimming pools. No drinking or driving. Like I said, remember all the kids are back at school, running around, trying to get to school. Be on the lookout for them. Um, that is it for my recapping the summer. Thank you for watching. Bye.